Yeah, hi, hello to everyone. This is Shanmugaraj. Welcome to my channel. One of the aims of this channel is to build a global knowledge sharing platform in the domains of leadership, agile, and project management. You can join me and help me with that either by subscribing to this channel or sharing my videos to our friends. Right? So having said that, let us get into today's video. Currently, we are discussing some of the leadership ideas from MID Sloan School of Management. Today's topic is A Playbook, Six Steps to Launching Productive A Projects. This particular article has been published last month, June 28, 2024. Why does it matter? In his new book, Eric Siegel argues that organizations need a business paradigm for running mission learning initiatives. Yeah. So in his new book, the A playbook, Mastering the uh, Rare Art of Mission Learning Deployment, Siegel makes the case that you know organizations are not seeing value from AI because they lack an effective business paradigm for running machine learning projects. Because most machine learning projects are highly technical, they often fall under the domain of experienced data science professionals. The result is a disconnect between the data experts preparing the data and developing and operating AI models and the business stakeholders in charge of running large scale operations who stand to benefit from productive insights, right? So by focusing so much on the modeling science rather than its deployment, it's like being more excited about rocket science than actual launch of the rocket, right? So that's where we are today. To boost success, businesses need a standardized playbook for machine learning projects that is accessible to business professionals and can help them participate in the life cycle of productive analytics projects. So let us talk about six steps for launching machine learning projects that has been discussed in that book, right? To bridge the divide, right? Siegel advocates this something he calls as business ML, right? A set of business practices for running productive machine learning projects. So he outlining uh, as six steps to foster collaboration among the business and technical stakeholders throughout all the phases of machine learning deployment. The first step is being establish a deployment goal, right? To derive any real value from machine learning, businesses need a defined value proposition that details how the technology will impact operations, right? So data science can't do this in a vacuum. So it is important that business stakeholders who are intimately familiar with the pain points and opportunities are technologically savvy enough to participate in realistic goal setting. The second step being establish the prediction goal, right? So while modeling and prediction involve complex mathematics, business goals need to be kept in mind. Business users need to have a semi-technical understanding of the technology so they can share their specific domain knowledge while also defining what the machine learning model is intended to predict for each use case, right? The third step is establish the right metrics. Determine the salient benchmarks to track during both model training and model deployment. In addition, identify what performance levels must be achieved for the machine learning project to be considered a success. Typically, most machine learning projects are grounded by technical metrics such as precision, recall, or accuracy. Organizations need to shift their focus to business metrics like profit, return on investment, savings, and customer acquisition. The fourth step is being prepare the data. Define what the training data should look like and ensure that data is in the desired format. This critical step is non-negotiable because it's the linchpin to experiencing high-value results, right? 
The fifth step is train the model, right? The next, the prepared data is used to train and generate a productive model. Data experts lead the charge here, but there is always a room for additional business input. The final step is deploy the model, right? Use the model to render predictive scores and in turn use those scores to improve business operations. It is also important to maintain the models through ongoing monitoring and periodic refreshing, right? So while the last three steps are more technical than the first three, all of them require a deep collaboration between the technology and business stakeholders, right? So building bridges to connect the two camps uh, requires investment and engagement in the right uh, change management practices to ensure adequate understanding of machine learning across stakeholders throughout the business. This will come to the conclusion of this video. So hope you guys got a better understanding how to go about standardizing your uh, steps for launching predictive analytics projects, right? So we talked about six steps and building a uh, playbook, right? It starts with going ahead with deployment goal, and then you go with prediction goal, and then you go with the uh, business KPIs, and then you go to technical steps like preparing the data, modeling it, and then deploying the model, right? So first three steps are more business intensive, last three steps are more technology intensive. So at every step, you need to have a good collaboration between the data scientists and business stakeholders. So that leads to a success, right? I hope you guys like this kind of videos that helps you to become a better leader. So with that, I'm signing off. See you in next video.